now. Hey, are you guys just going at it? Or are you button checking? All right, so we so we got Perseus versus Ghostly. Perseus, one of our Captain Falcon players here, and looks like Ghostly bringing out the Wii Fit trainer. Perseus, another member member of the Falcon Boys. Yeah. Now, Wii Fit, okay. We have not seen. Personally, I have not seen any Wii Fits at no. this tournament so far. No, this would be the first that I've seen. This is the first Wii Fit we are seeing. Yeah, and Ghostly also new to this tournament, at least from my knowledge. This is your first one, right, Ghostly? Yeah, so it's first one here. Percy is extra a very solid Falcon. I see he's been working on his movement. Yeah, he was talking Something to me. Something I like to see. He's been working on his tech and playing a lot more patiently the instead of going for those kills a lot. I, I would love to see. I would love to see it. Yeah, so uh, we Fit Trainer is going to have a lot of good spacing tools with the soccer ball or the volleyball and the sun salutation. If Perseus isn't careful, he could get zoned out pretty easily. Yeah, the one thing I'm going to see is we Fit struggle to probably get some kills. Um, yeah. You know, the aerials really aren't going to do it. No, up, tilt, up tilt to up smash is a true combo, but I have no idea what percent. I don't know this character at all. Yeah, uh, forward tilt is a really strong we Fit Trainer move because it hits in front of her and behind her. And it's got a lot of knockback. I think uh, 110, 115, it might kill Captain Falcon off the edge. Um, but it looks like they're jumping right into it. And they're on. Uh, yeah, Meverse, which I think I don't, be. I don't know why. I feel like that's too good of a stage for Falcon. Yeah, but it's, it's really hard to give it up. But Wii Fit Trainer might be able to bounce those volleyballs right across those yeah, little platforms okay. and space out pretty well. She's, she's doing pretty good so far. Yeah. Perseus is just trying to get his, his up air his up air combo. It's the bread and butter stuff. Yeah, it looks like Ghostly's doing a good job keeping him up in the air. They do finally manage to get back down to the neutral and kind of go at each other. I would like to see maybe a few more grabs instead of dash attacks. Yeah. Just, just because you can convert much more off of it. There we go. He only gets the single up air off that down grab. But at least he's maintaining stage control and yeah, keeping the fit trainer on the air. Oh, yeah. There we go. Yeah, I like that. I love to see that command grab being used. Yeah, not enough Captain Falcon players actually use it as an attack. Oh, so oh, oh Perseus, what a good I was just going to say, bad idea, but there we go, baby. Yeah, it looked like he was waiting for the spot dodge, but it ended up coming out as a forward or a we down fit, smash. We fit has very strange hitboxes and hurt boxes. Yeah, she just, really ducks down a lot on yeah. many of her attacks. That, that probably would not have hit any other characters. It's just her leg was out. Yeah, and Perseus didn't even have to tilt it down. It was just a uh, straight. Well, it's Perseus. Perseus is showing a lot of control. I would not keep going for that. But yeah, he's really running away with this game right now. He's got a lot of. He can pretty much go for whatever he wants. Are we gonna see a stomp. Yeah, Perseus really likes to do that grab release. Oh, again, wow. twice. Yeah, Ghostly didn't... really needs to be a little more patient. You should never be walking into two fully charged forward smashes. Yeah, and when you've got the tools to space out and outrange a Captain Falcon. You should definitely be doing that. You should right? not be. See, we fit. We fit can even just crouch, and then it won't get hit by it. Yeah, yeah. She's got one of what is it? The she lowest has the crouch. The lowest game? crouch. Yeah. Um, looks like we're gonna have a little change up of the controls here. Like if uh, if if Ghostly does see that Perseus wants a lot of dash grabs, she could just start crouching. It's just like with Kirby and Game and Watch. You can't you can't grab them. We got some, uh, I guess we got some control. Oh, I think maybe his uh, right trigger, I saw him hitting it, his right trigger was not putting up the shield, even though he did have it set up right. Uh, should have should have caught it a little earlier. Though. Yeah, it's much too late for yeah. some Johns now. You can't. Well, I don't think it's that won't even be Johns. Yeah, yeah. but it really was. I mean, Other than like the last one, much too late now. The first match has to stick. I, there's really no way around it. But. Maybe we'll see a maybe we'll see a whole new player now. Yeah, I mean he should he definitely should have. Ghostly it Ghostly out, came out the gate swinging. He was doing real good at the first. Yeah, and now that you mention it, I didn't see him put up the shield or dodge yeah, once. No. So. No, but but like like I said, there's no way you should ever walk into two fully charged forwards. And, and you know what? He did a button check. They did a button yeah. check beforehand. So I don't know how that's that true. Odd. That's what a button check's for. Check, oh. check your buttons. Oh, yeah. The, the switch makes sense. That was a pretty commanding game one. Yeah, and Ness, I think, is a really good matchup against Captain Falcon. I think he's definitely got an advantage in that matchup. He can edge guard him with the PK Thunder. Yeah. Not much Falcon Perse can do about that. Perseus doesn't seem like he likes to be off stage a super, super a lot. You can you can gimp a Ness very easily, but you gotta be you gotta be careful with your timing because you don't want to eat a PK Thunder two to the face. Exactly. You never want that. And then again, he did have such a commanding lead. There really was no reason for him to go off and risk there we go. the game. Yeah, good gentleman. Laying down that pressure with the jab. Oh yeah. That could have been a 
up air. Yeah, Ghostly does a really good job getting back on stage with the forward air to the dash attack. Keeping them up on the platform. Yeah, that's really smart. Every time I see that forward smash, I cringe a little bit because that's Yuki gets punished so hard for that move. Yeah, oh, doesn't actually get the tech on the platform, so the forward air is going to follow up, even though at that percentage. There we go. Nice. Oh, wow. there we go. Oh, there you go, Perseus. There we go. That Falcon. That, that special Falcon heel yeah. dirty combo. Yeah, and we saw it last game. He went for the grab release to the up tilt, but he kind of got it this time. As a Ness, you got to be careful with coming back to the stage. Falcon has the tools to stop you. Yeah, after you get released from the grab, the most common thing you're going to want to do is mash that jump button, and Percy smells that. Back throw not going to quite do it. Oh, there we go. That was a per yeah, I, I don't even know if he air dodged that. No, that was just his up beat. Uh, I don't think Ness has a jump here. No, that's it. No, that's it. That's a quick 2-0 for Perseus. Good, good games to Perseus.